Hello, good morning to everybody. So today uh, we are going to discuss about the biomedical instrumentation. Myself, uh, L. Nagarajan, working as an assistant professor in the Department of uh, Electric and Electronics Engineering in uh, MAM School of Engineering, aggregated by NAC, approved by AACT New Delhi, affiliated to Anand City Channel. <coughs> Okay, biomedical instrumentation. So the first unit we are going to discuss about the biopotential generations and the electrotypes and along with that we will be discussing about the recording problems. <coughs> so before we are going to study the biopotentials we should know what is the potential occurred in the bio in the cells. Okay, so for that we should know the cells first. Okay, so this is the structure of the cells. This structure of the cell is common to humans as well as the animals. Okay, except to plant, all the living beings that uh, humans and animals will have the same type of uh, structures. In this, first uh, the very important thing is the cell membrane. The reason why the why I have taken this cell structure for you to explain uh, apart from the sub, apart from the syllabus is the cell membrane you should know what is mean by cell membrane so the cell membrane is the membrane where it uh, encloses all the cell components inside the cell okay the cell membrane is the outer cover of the cells okay so this cla this uh, classifies the uh, number of cells okay this is the protects the cells that is the components present inside the cell next one is biopotentials okay the origin of the biopotential so first we should know where the biopotential occurs the biopotential occurs um, <coughs> electrical activity of the cells electrical activity of the cells the electrode potential is, as I said in the previous slide, cell membrane. The potential between the inside the cell and outside the cell, we call it as biopotentials. Okay, so where this biopotential occurs? What is the reason for this biopotential? It is nothing but the constituents of the cells. Okay, the ions present inside and outside the cell will produce these biopotentials. Okay, that potential is explained by the nurse to potential and he has proposed an equation E equal to minus uh, brackets RT divided by NF and the inverse of A1 and A2 whereas this A1 and A2 are the activities of the ions on either sides of the membranes and R is the universal gas, gas constant and T is the absolute temperature and is the valence of the ions F is the Faraday's constant now so uh, as I said earlier the ions present inside and outside this uh, cell we constitute the biopotentials. This biopotential is classified into two categories. One is resting potential and another one is action potential. Okay. The resting potential is occurred in our body when we are sitting ideally without doing any work. Okay. Even uh, when we are simply sitting also okay, and we are listening some music, whatever it can be. And uh, without any sweatings, very important point. Without any sweatings, if you are doing, if you are, uh, if we are being ideal, then that is called as resting potential. That is, when we are taking rest, the potential of the uh, cells we call it as resting potential. So, at that condition, the sodium ion, positively charged sodium ion, will be present outside the cell membrane and chloride that will be that is negatively charged will be present inside the cell membrane okay so the potential difference between outside and the inside will be this minus 60 volt okay it will be in terms of minus 60 volt to 2 minus 10 uh, millivolt okay so this is called as resting potential Okay, resting potential will be in negative. And next, uh, action potential. So, 
Previously, I discussed about the resting potential, that is the potential uh, of our cell when we are taking rest. Now, we want to do some action. Action can be anything, okay. It can be an, uh, listening some uh, music or view, visualizing some uh, uh, movie or running or uh, walking, okay. Even when we are sitting in an AC room, if you are, if you, if we are seeing the horror movie, we will feel, uh, uh, we will feel so sweating. Okay, so that is, we are sitting and listening to the movie, but we are feeling sweating. Okay, that is called as action. That is happening inside the cells without any physical activity. Okay, so this action potential is. The outside of the cell will be positive negative and inside of the cell will be positive okay so here what happened actually the previously in the resting potential the sodium ion is present outside of the cell membrane and the chloride is inside the cell membrane now when this action is taking place the sodium present outside is transferred into the cells and the chloride that is present inside is let outside the cell okay at this condition in the sorry in the action this action potential the cell membrane volt the cell voltage will be plus 20 volt okay it will be in positive voltage next this is the uh, pictorial uh, the 